Hello, I don't want to do the intro, so that's what we're doing. Anyways, so uh, today I didn't expect to record a video. I wasn't expecting to record anything, honestly. But I'm bored, and I'm extremely bored. And every time I think of things, I get even more bored. So we're doing a makeup video. <laughs> I have a reference photo up, but I'm not going to show it until the end so you guys can compare and see if I did a good job. Um, but other than that, uh, I was supposed to have a phone call, so I didn't want to record anything. But thinking about it, I'm bored. I woke up at 8 in the morning today, and uh, year? So as I do this makeup, I will why is this mirror so dirty but as i do my makeup i'll talk about what it has been going on why i didn't upload a wednesday video so yeah basically something happened on wednesday i received a package i received a delivery of a nintendo switch i recorded a whole um reaction of me opening it up <laughs> I'm so sorry. I just got my Nintendo Switch. And when I opened it up, this happened um so since that happened i have been relatively down because i feel as though i have nothing to do even though i'm trying to do everything i did before that happened but no in my brain i am still suffering from that so i don't know what to tell you but yeah i'm gonna use some old palettes for this probably gonna put some glitter i really don't know i just want a glam version of this just something really cute or whatever um but yeah we're just we're just going i did something similar before like but you know yeah i'm not gonna really talk about the makeup though because i just want to talk in general i don't know what else you know to do oh my god i'm going crazy anyways but yeah so i was obviously upset so i went ahead and started like trying to figure out a way to contact uh the store i'm not gonna say the actual name because if i do i don't want to get um into a controversy i don't want no one attacking me you know like i'm a relatively small channel i barely get any views i don't want no tea no shade no drama so oh my god this i forgot this probably has some black in it great okay but yeah so i don't want to i messed up this eye already but great you just started and you messed up try to call nothing phone calls can't happen apparently because um of what's going on in the world and then i tried um the chat and they told me to go to the store i thought the store was actually open the store wasn't open it hasn't been open for a really long time it's been closed because of the pandemic but yet the workers the actual workers i asked is it open and they're like yeah, it is. Ma'am, it's not. So I went to the store for no reason. What freaking brush can I use to blend this out if all of my brushes are dirty? Jeez. I'm just gonna stuff a blue color in there. But yeah, so I tried to talk. I quit. So we're back. Um, I decided to do it a different way i redid this eye because 
trying to save time in this video, you know what I mean? I already said so much information, might as well keep it up in here. But yeah, so I went ahead and talked to somebody else because I went all the way up there for no store to be open for me to return this. And they were literally doing the same thing. I told them, yo, the store is closed. Why are you trying to send me back to get this fixed if I can't even get this fixed? You know, like, not fixed, but returned at the store. There's no store to be able to return it to. So, they told me I can return it online. Well, like, they'll pick it up and they'll send me a new one. So I'm like, okay. I'm still upset. Uh, this was my mood the whole time of trying <laughs> to get it back. That whole night, I was just... Well, it's been a great day today. Can't wait for more. <laughs> like, I'm not trying to sound like a spoiled brat or anything. It's just... I've been waiting for so long to get this, and I even paid like $18 extra, and I barely get money in, so you know that like, that was like $300 for Animal Crossing and this, and I'm just like, yo, for real, you really do me like this, I bet, I see how it is. Yeah, why is this looking so freaking patchy? Jeez, I'm trying to get some of this. Anyways, but I've been trying for so long to get this, and when I finally have it, it's broken. But yeah, you know, it's okay. I didn't, I didn't need to have this anyways. It's not like I'm suffering from boredom or or whatever for like this whole time of quarantine. Um, but. And then I realized I could have just brought it on Target because Target had it. Um, but okay. I'm fine. I'm not suffering. I am not completely suffering. Okay. But yeah. So I'm just, you know, doing my thing. And I'm just gonna wait. I'm not gonna look at um, the... I'm trying to avoid anything that has to do with... Um, the switch i'm trying to avoid looking at the switch that i have because at this point i don't know what else to do um i'm just avoiding everything at this point for that i did buy a case like a case kit from amazon just so when i get the new one I can right away get a screen protector and everything, and I got it for $40. It comes with the screen protector, the travel case, the regular, like, grip case for the um, Nintendo Switch. It comes with a stylus, headphones, and then, like, a game cart case as well. So, all that for $40. And my friend was like, oh, I should have got that instead. I'm like, that's why you go on Amazon to buy these things. But, um, I'll most likely get the case and stuff before I get the Nintendo Switch. Because they did say my Nintendo Switch will get here, um, June. Well, somewhere in June, because they're shipping it June 7th, June 4th. Like, that's when they're, they said they're going to ship it. I'm here, like, I paid to get it in four days and you're giving me this in um 45 days okay i have to wait a lot and i'm i, I don't want to but you know this is things that are out of my control um so i'm just not gonna even look at the shipping if it delivers faster than that, I will be relatively surprised, but at that point, like, I'm probably going to be too busy to even play because I have summer classes, but we'll see how it ends up going at this point, because I honestly don't even know. 
just trying to live my best life at this point. Now, you're probably thinking, what does this have to do with the Wednesday video? Um, well, that has a lot to do with it, actually, because Wednesday was the day that I was getting it, so I was already ex super excited, I was already gittery, I've been waiting for a while to get it, to play Animal Crossing and stuff, like, um, some people might think, like, oh, you're jumping on the hype. Well, kind of and not kind of, because I was genuinely interested in the game, I didn't just want to play it just because everyone else is playing it it's genuinely a good game and i'm about to start crying but it's genuinely a good game and at this point like i'm just like i just wanted to play it um i've been playing the pocket camp one and i was legit crying all night about like just i was trying to play it and i just i couldn't get into it they ask you how you are you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine but you just can't get into it because they would never understand but um at the end of the day you know at least i'm getting a replacement you know it's gonna take forever but uh at least i'm getting a replacement um i just want to like stop thinking about it and like get busy i've been trying to do everything i used to do before i was gonna get it and it just didn't work out like, the Wednesday video was me, like, unboxing and everything. Like, I already showed you the footage at the beginning. And then, I had no other plans. So, w me trying to edit that video and act like everything is fine isn't really my style. I don't want to act like everything is okay if it's not. Like, I... It really put a downer because I already had, like nothing to really do nothing to keep me busy and that was like my ultimate plan to get me busy other than recording and editing videos because honestly i post twice a week if i continuously pre-record videos like at one point i'm just gonna be uh burnt out and not have anything to do so i've been trying to ultimately do a schedule especially now that i don't have like finals is over and everything i have nothing to really do other than youtube videos you know so i wanted that to help me uh be a distraction because watching youtube videos all day honestly gets boring after a while there's nothing really much to do um i can exercise and all that but like out like that's kind of what I've been doing, but there's so much you can do in a day, and I don't know. I just personally can't get into it, and I've been trying. I have four days until class starts again, and I don't know. At this point, so it's it's been a lot for me, and I'm trying my best to just get back to the routine I had before I had this like slight chance of happiness <laughs> but yeah how have been you guys and your quarantine or whatever you're doing right now like has it been good has it been bad has it been meh is there any new things that you guys been doing that has been really helping you guys out with quarantine because i'm trying to figure it out if it's um animal crossing i was about to say same but like <laughs> last um saturday video i was gonna use this one but then i told you like it wasn't gonna fit the whole thing so i'm just gonna use it this week because it matches i feel it hurts more when um, you are about to, like, have it in your hands, and then it, it just, it's in your hands, and you can't even use it. Like, I feel like that's the worst. Like, when you're so close, but yet so far, it just breaks your spirit sometimes. Especially since, like, that's money that I don't get that often. Like, I, I don't get stuff for myself that often because I don't get the money for it. And I passed 
all my like finals and stuff and that was kind of a gift for myself i never really got a gift like that when i was a child my family was never like the family to have the money for things like that so i don't know the fact that i was able to do it able to spend that money for myself um after a while of just not really having much for myself to be actively happy and then just like losing it right away kind of like bothered me a bit but you know i'm trying not to get too depressed about it i already was pretty depressed i'm trying to find ways to kind of forget about it but i don't have anything to really keep me productive like crazy during the day so it's kind of getting a little harder and harder every day to figure out how to distract myself from everything that's going on in the world and especially like not having something to keep me productive like all my friends have it and i'm here like i was about to have it i mean that means something right so this video isn't me trying to like rub it in your faces that i have this like it's not trying to be like oh i'm split being like i'm spoiled or whatever it's more so like this is how i'm feeling and what environmental factors are really affecting me in ways because it's good to be truthful about these things like it's never good to hide it especially when you're on such a platform you know i guess for not being the type of person to be very upfront about my feelings um it's surprising for me just to talk about like things like this and especially like some of my rent videos or some of my videos that I'm just like being trying to be very personal like I don't want to seem like I'm trying to fake my feelings and trying to like like create drama or just like be very emotional because I am generally a very emotional person like I'm a Leo for gosh sakes like girl like i I'm a very emotional person and it just sometimes gets to me and I try to like keep doing YouTube videos because the main reason for me to come on YouTube was so I can be more like creative and have like more for me, more an outlet to feel a lot healthier or just to have kind of a distraction. It was more for me than actual like youtube content for people to watch like i could have just private this but like what's the point of posting it if i'm a private it i don't know just me rambling about it but it like if someone comes down and starts watching my videos and actually start enjoying my content i'll be very grateful like i'm already grateful for like those extra views that i get but being like but i don't feel like i will ever like get to the point where i'm like an actual like youtuber or a content creator or just like a person that's partnered with youtube like i don't feel like i'll ever get to that but if i do i'm grateful for you guys for doing that for me but at this point like i don't feel like i'm gonna get that far i had this youtube channel for i don't even know how long like i've had it since 2009 but i i used to post videos but i um private it all because it was just me in middle school i know i said i didn't like this but honestly it it really does set i just don't like the smell of it um but yeah back to the topic at hand i just after a while i just felt like i didn't want to post anything because I didn't feel happy posting anything. I felt like it was more of a chore. So now that I want to be back to that headspace of um, me being creative and stuff, I just want to post videos and do it for me and edit and just like really be a little bit more creative. But at the end of the day, if I don't feel up to it, I'm not going to force myself to post the video especially if i'm not in the headspace to do it or i don't want to burn myself out because the whole point of me doing youtube is to make myself feel kind of like a little bit better about myself 
and feel like I'm like being creative or whatever but if it comes to the point where I don't feel creative anymore I'm not going to start posting videos like that like I'm going to take a break I'm not going to force myself to please people when I'm not feeling pleased with my content and I've said that before I don't know how many times I've said that like this content I want to create content that I actually appreciate and like and if I don't appreciate and like it I'm not gonna post it and I just been more in my head lately not just because of me having a broken Nintendo Switch Lite more so just like I always learn to distract myself from my feelings and when I don't have a distraction I start getting in my head I start getting insomnia I start just not focusing on anything and it just gets hard sometimes to figure out what to do in life and I I just want to just figure out a way to cope with all these things but I'm gonna do the final details on camera Yeah, that hair was probably... So... I should put a better little detail, right? One sec. Is it better? But yes, so this is the reference photo. This is my face. Um, yes, I've been feeling like a clown. That's the video. It's kind of a look, to be honest.